If you're interested to make money on the internet in a professional way, then this video is for you. I want to show you a special tool that utilizes advanced AI technology to create very beautiful the products presentations. So I'm speaking about seller pick set of the tools that allowed you sell your products online. But it's not just the products, it's integrated them showing a natural environment with like a models, how to use placement, which is help kind of visualize uh, them how they are using. So it's kind of very nice about this. And also UI design very natural. So for me, it was very easy. I did not even read manual. I just opened a natural flow. So I will give him 10 out of 10 for the UI because it does actually work very well. And also it's a layered. Layered, that means it's a simplest at the beginning, but if you need advanced functionality, it's there. So you actually can work with this, which is a big, big bonus for me. If you look right here, we have it at the beginning, a different styles instantly when you log in. So do you want a different accessories try on you want close virtual face lip syncs image to which we actually on those two ones i'll show you but uh what they can do but mostly we will probably focus on this virtual try on and some accessories and by the way i will show you some very cool tips to make it even work better so below you can notice you have the products you can put it just spotlight i mean this is um sweet for the creators to display their products and it's work excellent well, let's start with this first we'll go to virtual try on let's go inside here and on the bottom you can see creation so i already did create uh plenty so how i say before uh, likely i have created and i can play around the experiment see what's working what doesn't work but right there we have creation and let's say we want to do uh, work with our clothing as we go inside, we can upload the image first of our products. And you can see right here, you have a selection from some that you maybe already uploaded. And I have some mine stuff that I already did. You can also have it upload from your device. Like right here, I have a device of different images and we'll do this as well. And other ones, interesting things, you can directly connect to Shopify and use it items already on your store. It's meaning if you create printable t-shirt and you put it and you see your sales a little bit low. Many times I found out it's because it's not presenting well. It's maybe nice design, but when people can see this design on specific model, it's make a huge difference. Then people can visualize in the mind instead this model, how it's look or different figure type. And it says, OK, will it work or not? So it's a reason why it is actually increasing. And by the way, before I select this, you can see they have a different body shapes. Well, let's go ahead, try Shopify. For this, you do need to connect to your Shopify account. It was very simple. I just click on account. It says, do you want to install plugin? Yes. Of course, you will need to have it set up your Shopify store. And I set up three, four minutes. I mean, it's very fast to stop Shopify. By the way, right here, you can see I'm on a trial because I'm like, let me try this. But it is right now the run promotion is only one dollar for three months. So you can dollar a month, sorry, dollar a month for three months. So you can launch, see if it's working or not connection. And if it's not just cancel. So three dollars, it's like super cheap. OK, and then next so you can connect this way. And I would just create one t-shirt right here. So it's connected to this. We're going to select this t-shirt. You can see it is uploading. Notice also on the top, we have it tops, bottoms, full body, and one piece. So depend on what type of the garments you're selecting, the models will select appropriately to this. Of course, right here, it says predefined male, female, but we can always click on view all models so we can preview the models. And inside here, we have it options. Just scroll down if you want to look through all of them. Or you can narrow it down by selecting, for example, female, adult. And let's go like short sleeve so we can narrow down and see it. And you can see it's already kind of helped to us. Well, I'm going to select maybe this model. And as I'm selecting on below, we have it adjust area. If you remember previously, I says it's a layering system. So you don't need to go too far down. But if you want to adjust, you also have this additional layer of the 
advanced functionality. So let's just, as we're exploring, I want to show you. We'll click here and you notice it is coming with masking tool. Masking tool, it's help us define area where we want to do. I will show you reason why we want sometimes adjust a little bit later when we walk on special Rococo dress, like out of this world dress. But this is in the future right now. I'm checking and you see this pink color mask and I think it's actually select properly. If not, we can deselect, use it like lasso. We can use the also brush tool like right here, select this different size. For example, if right now I'm just creating T-shirt, T-shirt will be tackle in the pants because notice right here, if we look closer, you'll notice the mask end up right above the belt line. So it's meaning if I recreate this way, our T-shirt will get it tackle in the pants. If I want to do T-shirts longer and stick out, I'm just going to take this brush and brush right here. So this way I will tell AI that it's okay to use it in this area to place the item. So it's work very well in this case, like this maybe. Then we're done. Let's click confirm. And you can see right here, it's actually showing where it's going. Confirm one more time. And now we're ready to create. If I click right now, generate, it will create four different types. Or we also have it one cool new features that is, I think, awesome. It is pose variations. So we click on this, you can notice we have a different poses. When you look on a one model and you see stay up front, sometimes it feels, uh, how does it look on the back? How does it look on the side? So right here, you actually can create it. And I'm going to check a few of them, like right here, let's go four. We can select back front as well, if you need it. And of course, if you don't like it, just click and deselect them. It's very easy. And each of these, it will present one credit. And I think this is actually very well suited for us because in some services, when I went and it says, hey, we give you 500 credits, but one, the lowest render was required 10 credits. So technically give me less credits. In this case, it's meaning one render, one credit, which is kind of makes sense. Well, let's go ahead, click generate. As it's generating, it's put on our server we can still go ahead and create another. So let's do this till this is generated and creating for us, we can continue to develop another products. Right now you saw that product was created from our Shopify store where we took it from. So let's create just different one. I'm going to select and upload it from device. So in here, I will just select this fancy Rococo dress. Let's go open. If you notice, I was on only top tab. However, the system is actually scanning, identifying what type of garments I have it. And based on this, will provide me suggestion and says, hey, this is a look just like a one piece item. Well, let's go change. I click confirm and you can see right here, I switch it as well as my model is switch as well also. So I'm going to select some model and we can select different one. Let's go with first what's predefined. But if you look there, we have a lot of different selections again by the age and everything. I'm going to adjust this. And the reason is why I'm going to adjust because if I'm rendering this way, what's happening there, you, you see the area and because it's AI kind of try to place in, I define what area AI can only change. So it's mean if dress is very fluffy, very big one, it will try to squeeze in this area. Or if I make it short, it will try to make short. So what we can do, we can select our brush. Let's go create just a little bit bigger, like maybe even this bigger brush. And because this is bigger dress, I can also just go and says, you know what? Go crazy for me. Let's go like all the way down. I want bigger dress and I want to create like huge space, like right here. See what I did? I just says I want low dress. I want a very big dress, kind of crazy almost. Yes. What I told AI to use this area freely right here. So don't just worried about the backdrop and we'll just create like this. There you go. Yes, it, it is look as a big blob. Okay, let's go click 
confirm this one confirm here again and the reason i did because you see how it's fluffy everything so we'll go and create this let's click on our poses and i will just take these these just three poses should work we could also um you know what let's do all let's do all six poses right now yeah, we'll go ahead and click generate well and i see the other one's already done we can click and preview so this is t-shirt that we just created we took this t-shirt from our shopify store brought in we adjust our mask because i want to show the full link of the t-shirt so we modified this one instead tackle and you can see right here is going perfectly at the bottom right there we can come and look a little bit closer on our design i like how it's fit and also wrinkles look very natural we can preview also sideways so you can see how it's look and a little bit closer on the design so you can see how well it and it is look very natural it's look like a model was there I am professional photographer and I do a lot of photo shoot with the models for different products and trust me it is very expensive if you try to hire models you need to pay makeup well let let me share you pay for your studio hours you pay for the equipment you pay for the makeup artist hairdresser you make for the dressers you make for the helpers you pay for the photographer post and prayer processing i mean i can go on and on and trust me this is expensive well and if you're interested you can watch some of my uh, previous video how i done this i have it even time lapse how we did it or shop and photography i got examples there it's just tell you that i'm not telling you it's real it's what i'm doing and compared to this i can create much faster and if you photographer this tool you should get because it saves you a lot of money you can photo shoot your models yes right here you don't restrict just to use it their models you can also well let's go create next you can go click on a custom and you can create your own models you can upload it here like higher model photo shooting different poses put it here and now you have it, your unique model in your library ready for any other dressing so you don't necessarily need content creator you can be photographer and use exactly the same tools that save you a lot of time and money and creating for the products okay i think our address is ready let's look what we have here and you can see how fluffy it is compared from what was before it is right link we have it beautiful even on a bag display but if we look front look on this close-up very nice close-up on our address we have it also properly linked you see how it's going and the same what i was worried like a hips example you can see right here how wide going on this dress so the dress is look correct so this one it's a with a mask and this is kind of a tip what i was saying to you if you just take straight forward and put it there you'll notice your dress will be very slim so you want to create this special area to tell ai hey it's fluffy dress use all this area don't restrict ai let's look on other things what i want to show you is with the accessories because we are creating dress we're creating all of this nice but sometimes maybe you have a very nice piece of jewelry you know you maybe create like dragon brush or other things in here i want to show you what we can do so let's go ahead and my upload it and i want to just see what i have it and right there is, look i have a beautiful dragons i'm going to select the dragon here uh, we can change size if you need but i think that is fine and let's put it somewhere like right here earrings well if i go click just by default it should bring but what i want to do because i think this should be a little bit bigger I, I think earrings and if i want to create a bigger size again we'll go with our adjustment area and we'll just take a brush right here and i want just like create bigger you know if you have a hard time let's do this let's go zoom in closer 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 so we zoom in we have it much easier now control and i want to create like this probably dragon yeah i want to put a dragon around here like this big dragon yes <laughs> it's what we're going to do okay now let's click confirm and you can see on our preview we have this area selected where the dragon will be located i think this is kind of awesome one and we're going to click generate and right here we have our creation done 
notice how as well and naturally place it. Of course, you can change size by scaling or masking bigger or smaller area. This is help you to control view of your item. One more thing I want to show you before we jump to animations. You remember I told you about the belt line and right here is example. If you want to show your short or t-shirt toggle inside the pens, all what you need to do is just mask out like right here. Just put it mask above and you can see how AI recognize this and nicely toggle the short inside the pens to view. Well, we created all these beautiful designs. And for example, I do like how it's look nice, but you know what? You can have it even more magic to this. You can animate this. It will be excellent work for the Facebook, a TikTok or other things to give it even more attention to your products. It's actually very easy and fun to do. Well, let's show you how you can do it. At home, you can go to like, for example, a lip sync and notice right here or image. All what you need to do, just go click and upload it. You can select from your uploaded devices, like right here with T-shirt that we just generated already. We can use this. And let me show you what's how it will look. I love this one. This new floral design, totally unique. I haven't seen anything like it. The fabric is so... So you can see how naturally it's speaking. Um, small tip if you create your design just let them the funny jokes and you can all just tape in a text script and then you can post it on TikTok. i mean those things go viral like crazy but if you don't want to speak it's okay all what you can do just even simple animations look on this it is very natural animations i mean everything look on a belt how this movements it is five seconds very fast but right there what i like about animations we do can see pictures and we can see how the clothes looking <laughs> but when you add animations you can see the wrinkles moving you can see in emotions and they give it better understanding of how clothing will look on a person and that is very easy simple click and you create from your creations and a way more here we just i don't have enough time to go through everything included items different uh watches hats i mean it's a, so much there almost full pack of the tool just one last thing i want to show you that is kind of nicely surprised me that they have it options here and it's called publisher what publisher allowed you to do is have a calendar where you can select any date click on a schedule or you can do this from the products as well then you can go ahead and click on your creations like for example we create just video yes and we create this video so I create my creation I can put it captions what I wanted I select where I want to display TikTok, Instagram Facebook anywhere where I want it I can put this animation select when I want this to be displayed and schedule or save a draw. So, and that's what happening this time. It, and this preset time, this will go on your social media and bring attention to your products. Like you put a link to your Shopify. It says, hey, look at me. I have a new design of the short out. Go check this out. Just let you know, I use the similar schedule before for my Instagram posts and I paid about same price just for the scheduler. I'm not kidding. I'm seriously, it's just same about price just for the scheduler. And here is a part of all this tool. So how I said, it's a suite of the tools specifically designed for the creators who create the outfits, who create all different merchandise. And you can easy create, you know what? best way to do if you go and can try for yourself i will drop link down below for you so go see if it's work again that is not for your everyday kind of sit and have it fun this is professional set of tools and designed very well well thank you for watching this video and we'll see you next time